is Talk for Kids, and I'm here with the Notre Dame Leprechaun. So how do you train to be the Leprechaun? I definitely, I do a lot of push-ups mainly. I also work on my public speaking to make sure that I'm not making a fool of myself out in front of those big crowds. Also work with the cheerleaders to make sure I'm able to do a lot of those flips and stunts like that too. So how do you try and pump up the crowds like you were talking about? Uh, you'll get to see a little bit later tonight at the pep rally, but mainly what I try to do is I try to get the crowd involved by doing cheers with all the crowd. I try to get them standing up and on their feet, and I try to talk about things that they're going to be excited about, like Notre Dame football beating up on USC. It's going to be a team effort, not just for our players and coaches, but every single fan. So I want to start a cheer right here. I want you guys over here to be go, and I want you guys to be Irish, and I want to see how loud we can make this place. All right? Are, do you like talking with the other team's mascots or is it, are you mainly off by yourself? You know, it's, it's a funny question. We don't always interact that much, but a couple weeks ago, our last Notre Dame game, Utah's mascot came over and challenged me to a handstand competition, and I had to whoop him out there in front of 80,000 people. Is that like the only time that you really do it is when the other guys come over and challenge you or do you go and challenge them? Notre Dame is pretty, uh, they're pretty strict about, they don't want me going out and uh, you know messing around with the other mascots too much so I can get in a little bit of a cheap talk here or there but I can't let them know about it too much. When did you decide that you wanted to become the Leprechaun? You know I, uh, I transferred to Notre Dame actually, I didn't get in originally and then once I got in I, I saw the tryouts and I said man that would be sure would be pretty awesome to uh, go out there and interact with the crowd and get them all pumped up and have the best spot on the field too. What are the tryouts like? Tryouts a big process. It starts out about 30 guys and then they narrow that down to five guys. Those five guys do a tryout in front of the whole student body and then we do push-up contest, jig line, and then we do an interview with some of the leaders of Notre Dame too. So it's a pretty involved process. Well thank you for your time and good luck. Uh, thank you Nick. Go Irish. <laughs> This is Nick Garner for Sports Talk for Kids with the Notre Dame Leprechaun. Hey kids, let's talk sports.